Seriously, are those not the best looking prills you've ever seen? For the past few years, the undisputed champ of all natural organic fertilizers has been the notorious Molorganite fertilizer. But I recently just stumbled upon a new fertilizer that Lowe's just released. And not only does it have much better ingredients than Molorganite, but it's also much cheaper than Molorganite. So in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly what this fertilizer is, how it compares to Molorganite, and why this might just be the best new fertilizer of 2023. This is Star Green Natural Base Fertilizer. And if you guys don't know, Star Green is Lowe's budget generic in-house brand of fertilizers. But even though this is considered a budget fertilizer, it has a few tricks up its sleeve that you normally don't find in fertilizers inside the big box stores. So at first glance, this fertilizer looks pretty similar to Molorganite. It's got the blue bag, it's marketed as natural, and it's even sold right next to Molorganite inside low. But the main difference between these two is that Molorganite is made with biosolids, and this is made with kelp and humic acid. And in my opinion, that's a much better combination to make your fertilizer with, because biosolids, essentially, if you guys don't know, is treated sewage. This is doo -doo, baby. I said, ah! And if we directly compare this fertilizer to the Molorganite, we can see that it has almost three times as much nitrogen. And funny enough, it's actually almost the same price. And another thing to note about Molorganite is that it does contain a high amount of phosphorus, whereas this style green fertilizer doesn't contain any phosphorus. And that might sound like a good thing on Molorganite's part, but as I recently learned watching the Lawn Mentors video, that might not be as good as you might think. Hey Kyle, can you share some of your concerns that you have with using Molorganite? Hey George, it's good to hear from you. People have been on the Molorganite train for a long time and I did some research into it myself lately to see what all the buzz was about and came across some pretty crazy stuff. Did you know that that stuff actually has lead and arsenic in it? If I've got a choice between a fertilizer that has those things in it and a fertilizer that doesn't, you know I'm going to skip it every time that I can. And not to mention, you know what else it's got in it is a lot of phosphorus. You and me being neighbors across the lake know all about how that excess phosphorus, that can actually be a really big problem when it comes to algae blooms. And too much algae in the water is going to totally disrupt the rest of the wildlife that's there. And if you check out the bottom of the Melorganite bag, there's actually a little warning there too that talks about using too much phosphorus. Seems like a hard pass to me, man. Hey, thanks for having me on. Hope you're doing well. If any of you guys haven't checked out The Lawn Mentor, I'll link his channel below. He's always doing some fun experiments over on his channel. Now, another thing that's really beneficial about this fertilizer is that it contains 10% potassium. Now, if we take a look at the general three macronutrients, we got nitrogen, phosphorus, potassium. Potassium is the nutrient that helps with all around plant health. Now, this is gonna be especially beneficial to us right now during these summertime drought conditions because it's gonna help our grass handle drought stress much better. And a little known fact is that potassium is one of the most common deficiencies among homeowners lawns. And odds are, if you're watching this video, you probably have a potassium deficiency too. Another benefit to this fertilizer is that it contains humic acid. Now, before I start tooting the benefits of humic acid, I wanna be very transparent with you guys that I've only tried it a handful of times, and ultimately I decided it wasn't right for my program because the cost of benefit analysis just didn't add up for me. But the fact that we have an all-in-one fertilizer right now that contains humic acid, I'm certainly not opposed to trying it out again. Now, one of the most common benefits of humic acid is that it's a natural chelator. What that means is whenever you apply fertilizer, it helps unlock the nutrients of the fertilizer more efficiently so your grass can green up better and it can absorb those nutrients much better. Another benefit to this fertilizer is that it contains kelp. Now, I have a little bit of a confession to make. Just like humic acid, I've always been skeptical of the benefits of kelp. And I always just assumed it was- You assumed what, George? I'm just kidding, man. I thought the same exact thing about sea kelp for a while. But after testing it in a test plot in my own lawn, I really couldn't believe the results, to be honest. Sea kelp is an organic amendment that helps grass retain water longer, helps with nutrient uptake, greens up your lawn, and helps with various types of stress that your grass may be going through. Here are the results from a video I did earlier this year on sea kelp. So the test area I've been putting the kelp down in is basically in a line from this bed all the way to the fence line, and then all the way back to where the obvious color change is in the lawn. You can tell that this area is a lot darker green and it just looks a lot healthier in general. So one of the biggest things that stick out to me with the difference in this kelp where I put it down and where I didn't is in this spot right here. In this whole area, my lawn goes dormant first when it gets really hot out. And you can see the line right over here is still green where I put the kelp down and over here, it's starting to struggle a bit. So at this view, I think it's a lot easier to see the difference in color. You can definitely tell that this area of the lawn is much darker green than the area in my front lawn. 
George, I'm gonna be real with you. Since putting it down in that test plot, I've been applying it to the rest of my lawn, and I'm gonna say this is the best my lawn has looked all summer. No joke. Now that's what I'm talking about, Jesse. Thank you so much for sharing that with me and putting my skepticisms to rest. If you guys have never checked out Lawn Life, if you guys are looking for some of the highest quality results-driven content, make sure you guys go check them out. Jesse's the man. And if you guys are into budget fertilizers, then make sure you guys check out this video right here. In this video, I cover one of the cheapest liquid nitrogen sources on the market, and I had great results. And with that, this is George from Princess Cut. Peace.